to another tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to be teaching you how to make water do damage in Roblox Studio. And you might want this for something like a sinking ship game. So let's get started. First, you're going to go to Edit, and then you're going to go to Sea Level, and then you're just going to press Generate, and then here's your water. And I'm just going to change the color of it because it looks better if, when I change the color of it. So here we go. Um, I'll make the watercolor a little bit darker. All right, there we go. This looks better. And I'm going to make the waves a little higher. So there we go. Okay, so now we have our water. We're going to add the script that makes the water do damage. So inside terrain, insert a script. Now what you should know too... This is very essential if you're making a sinking ship game, but this is not so essential if you're making a game where you only want water to do damage and not um, and not other terrain. Because basically what the script does, it makes all terrain do damage, which is definitely not a problem if you're making a sinking ship game or a game where, you know, you want, you know, someone maybe for lava, like if you turn this water red and you want lava to do damage or something. Um, which is not a problem unless you have other terrain in the game and you don't want it to do damage. But yes, this script works perfectly fine and it does make water do damage. Okay, so we're going to go in here and just write this. Um, so I'm just going to have you copy this down. So I'm going to paste it right here. I already wrote this script, so I'll just have you copy it right here. And then this part you can change. So this 40 is the number of health, you know, the health um, you want the player to lose when they touch the water. So I'm just going to set it to 1. Actually, no, 5. So every time the player touches the water, he loses 5 health. Um, so this should work. Now we can test this out. I'm just going to delete the base plate. And we'll test this right now. And it's loading slowly. Oh, here it goes. So now we're in the game. And as you can see, we fall into the water and it does damage. And it does more damage. <gasps> and now it does even more damage. And then you die. But it takes a while. If you want it to take longer to do damage, then just set this number from like 5 to like 0 0.5 or something to less until you find something that's just right for your game. But yeah, so this is how you make water do damage in Roblox Studio. I hope you enjoyed, and if this helped you out, please like and subscribe. Thanks guys, I'll see you in the next video.